Day 12. Wait. Shit. Day 13. We are done with day 13. Day day 12 was a bad day. Let's not let's not remember day 12. It's 3 days with these braces in and they're not feeling good. They're not comfortable. So, my talking will not be the best, but we're going to try. Day 13. The th- final day of this rally i feel like at least this is my opinion they, they could still run next week who knows but i'm at least i'm gonna start try to stay away next week but the rally of uh black owned businesses and um companies so um cohn was a huge runner today we did not take any trades i felt like i was gonna be uh chasing if i would have taken any trades on that one but my fear of missing out did not trigger there which is good it's really good good discipline good good patience um one you are you one whatever the stock's called i think we traded it yesterday and made some money back that trade did me good today um we got a buy of the dip on a halt whenever the stock market opened and then we waited for it to come up off that dip and we sold a little early i just got in and out all once made about 400 and some change Good trade. Um, the reason I just got in and out was because it was so volatile. I was a little hesitant about it. Um, it did go up to 50. I got in at 44.90 and it went up to 50, but we got out at like 46.50, some change. But it went up to 50. Um, I could have scaled it out. I was just really scared and not in this like feeling good mentality in the moment because it was just like, this is so volatile. This could drop any second. Um, I did get a really good entry and I was testing out this strategy that I really like and it's buying these halts coming down. Um, those are huge dips and those halts are slowing down the momentum falling, the falling momentum and it's a good time to catch it at the bottom. And I actually did catch it right at the bottom. 40, uh, 44.90 was the exact bottom of that halt and I got it right in at that and man, it was a good entry. So. If I was looking back at it, I definitely want to want to hold a little bit longer, try to get up into um, some some uh, you know just ride the momentum until some resistance starts to hit. And I just kind of got off because it was really choppy, really up and down, up and down. Um, but we could have we could have easily seen a nice nice trade there if I would have. You know, in the, in the thousands plus today, if I would have just held on to it a little bit. But I'm really happy still with the day. $400 and some change after such a shitty day yesterday. I just wanted a green day. Um, I'm really happy. So I called it a quits. Going to study some more tonight. Really motivated, really excited about this next week because I feel like we're going to just do so much better because of just some learning. Getting, getting the jitters out, feeling better about it. And yeah, um, we are down about $100 on the week only a hundred dollars we were up almost 500 600 now we're down a hundred um we were down almost 14 1300 at one point so to come back to down at 100 i think that's a huge win for me so i'm gonna take it day 13 is done day 14 will come back monday um i may or may not play poker this weekend if we do play poker we will make a day 14 in the middle of this weekend so Depends on if I play poker or not. Not sure. Going to see how I feel and see if I want to take some money out of my bankroll. Um, That just depends on that. So, all right. Day 13 is a wrap.